there, I'm Naomi Kyle and this is IGN News. AT&T plans to raise concerns over net neutrality when the case moves deeper into the court process, citing violations of the First and Fifth Amendments of the Constitution of the United States. Additionally, the telecom plans to raise concerns that net neutrality violates the terms of the Communications Act of 1934. For those who don't remember their civics class, a quick refresher. The First Amendment to the U.S. Constitution prohibits the creation by Congress of any law that prohibits free speech. The Fifth Amendment requires that private property taken for public use is justly compensated. While not explicitly laid out in the statement of issues from AT&T, Ars Technica points out in its report that Verizon, in a similar earlier filing, claimed net neutrality violates the First Amendment by stripping ISPs of control over the transmission of speech on their networks. Ars also noted Verizon believed net neutrality takes network owners' property without compensation by mandating that companies turn over their networks at a regulated rate of zero. At the end of February, the Federal Communications Commission passed a historic ruling that classified internet service providers as common carriers under Title II of the 1934 Telecommunications Act. A request to delay the new net neutrality rules was denied at the beginning of the month by the FCC. For more on how corporations are taking control of the internet, stay tuned to IGN.